Hi, and welcome to NetApp QB TV. My name is Jonathan, and I'm a Senior Virtualization Engineer at NetApp. In this video, I cover the software licensing needed by Virtual Storage Console. This video is based on Knowledge Base Article 3010228. Virtual Storage Console is available as a free download for NetApp customers. The core functionality of Virtual Storage Console does not require having any software licenses. All that is required is using a VMware-supported storage protocol such as NFS, iSCSI, Fiber Channel, or Fiber Channel over Ethernet. There are additional features that Virtual Storage Console offers that do require the purchase of a software license. For example, if you choose to install the Backup and Recovery plugin during the Virtual Storage Console install, you must purchase a Snap Manager for Virtual Infrastructure license. There are a number of other features that Virtual Storage Console offers that also require a software license. The Backup and Recovery plugin offers the ability to update SnapMirror and SnapVault relationships. In order to use this feature, you must have a SnapMirror and or SnapVault license. Another feature that Backup and Recovery provides is the ability to perform restore operations. In order to perform a restore operation, you must have a Snap Restore license. In the provisioning cloning plugin, you can configure and manage deduplication settings. To do this, you need to have an ASIS license. If you are working with vFilers, you will need to have a multi-store license if using provisioning and cloning. Finally, a flex clone license is required if you are using provisioning cloning to clone virtual machines. A flex clone license is also required if you are using the backup and recovery plugin in an NFS environment, provided you are running a version of ONTAP prior to 8.1. You do not need a Flex Clone license if you are running backup and recovery in an NFS environment with one of the following versions of ONTAP. 7 mode data ONTAP 8.1 or later. Cluster data ONTAP 8.1.1 or later. I want to thank you for watching and I hope this has been informative.